welcome back to another episode of today's video like i promised you guys that i was going to be dropping three videos in a week yes like seriously i'm so sorry so that is why i had to just hasten up and you know film this video today and uh, make sure i drop it my channel today it was actually because of um our sales yes we're running our sales during that last week last two weeks and every as in i was so so busy i'm so sorry for that yeah but i'm back i'm back like a never left so on today's video i will actually be dropping her half cast body lotion you know i promised you guys that i was going to make this half cast of a thing a full kit for you guys to be able to make and use at your own comfort so yeah today i'm going to be giving you recipe for the half cast body lotion ciao, 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 ciao. somebody clapping already so yeah if this is your first time of seeing my face of seeing my video thank you so much for stopping by to watch my video yes we'll do skincare when we make reviews on skincare products we'll do pro mixing yeah yes and uh, how to make a safe ld skincare product and um talk about everything we do everything skincare yeah bother treatment just name it you can go on to our instagram page to actually view more of our product and um please do not forget to subscribe to this channel like this video share this video and give it a huge thumbs up you know what i mean <laughs> it's all my returning subscribers thank you so much for the love thank you so so much for your support i love you guys so very fast today I'll be teaching you on how to make your half cast whitening lotion. So just sit down and what? Relax. <laughs> yeah. I'll be introducing you to the whitening tubes that we're actually going to be using in formulating this half cast body lotion. You know, when making your lotions, the first thing you need to put in your bowl first is your tube. Like your whitening tubes. Yes, your whitening, your treatment tubes. First tube you'll be using is the Kojic clear papaya tube you also be using a avenome tube this is a avenome tube we're going to be using a ladakurai share tube two of this two of this koji clear papaya tube you get a clean sterilized bowl you are going to press out the tube in the clean bowl then also get three of the avenome tube press it out in the clean bowl as well and also you're going to get your share Ladakurai share tube. You are going to press it out as well in your clean bowl. After which you press everything into the bowl. Then you take your spatula or your whisk to mix it together in order for it to incorporate well to get the smooth consistency. The next thing you are actually going to do, you are going to harden your base cream. We're making use of our half cast base cream. When it can be used on the face and on the body. So this is the base cream we'll be using. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so we'll be using a 600 gram of this base cream in the mixture. So it is very, very good and it smells really, really great. Yeah, so in case you can lay your hands on this half cast base cream, you can actually make use of any base cream of your choice. If you actually have any base cream that works so well for you that you've been using or you know about and it works really great, please go ahead and use nothing spoiled. You understand nothing but you can actually use any good effective base cream that is effective on its own that can at least give a three shade tone on its own without from mixing it now you'll be adding this concentrate into the mixture two of this concentrate zero touch concentrate you'll be adding two of this into it and after adding two of this concentrate into it you'll be adding one pigment dough into heat this is it the pigment dough concentrate you'll be adding one of this into the mixture you'll be adding two of this rapid white white nizer into the mixture as well please don't forget to get the original the rapid white white nizer the original i dropped the video on how to identify the original from the face finally on the concentrate you are going to be adding one bottle of this one bottle of the kojic white concentrate into the mixture so the next thing you'll be adding now, adding 50 ml of your whitening repair milk into the mixture then you're going to be adding our whitening oil this oil is actually uh, one of our products you can use in the making of your face cream to further boost the efficiency 
it is very very great for the face and body whenever you're making your facial cream you can add it into it if you're making your whitening lotion any lotion you can add it into it to further boost the efficiency even for people that are not using our product you have your whitening lotion lightening lotion whatever thing you're using lotion on your skin you can actually get this from horse and actually mix it with your lotion it is a very very good oil it whitens the skin like i'm telling you and it glows the skin so well it repairs the skin clear off your discoloration your hyperpigmentation sun damage it is really really great can be used on the face and on the body so i'm going to be using a hundred ml of this into the mixture it is mild and yet very 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 effective so that is the only thing we'll be using it is so effective trust me and then finally finally we'll be using your rose seed essential oil we are going to be using 20 drops of this rose seed essential oil and also 20 drops of our tea tree essential oil in the mix and then you are adding your fragrance yes please whenever you're using fragrance please make sure you use original fragrance authentic fragrance don't go and get those synthetic fragrance that can damage your client's skin like use correct original fragrance that is why you see some people they will tell you oh when you're making your face cream don't put fragrance why because they're using synthetic fragrance buy original fragrance grade a fragrance that is quality authentic it is not synthetic one that can damage your client's skin or something because when you use synthetic product synthetic fragrance sincerely it's going to cause redness it might even cause pimple hyperpigmentation because it is synthetic but the truth about this fragrance is that it is expensive imagine you getting a fragrance for 50 ml for 3000 naira okay so for those of you that used to say oh Rhoda, your products are expensive my dear do you know how much we get a fragrance like the list of the products we use in formulating and producing those things you said you're using on your skin do you know how much we get it the fragrance 50 ml of it for 3000 naira now imagine you getting more than uh, so that is for you to know the quality we give when we are formulating our products we don't just do things because we want to mix but we make sure we give quality our products make smells really really amazing no ash smelling chemical kind of product no it smells really really great if you are my student you already know where you get your fragrance from your quality original fragrance undiluted one you already know where you get it from oh mix everything together and then you repackage into your desired container and trust me and trust me your skin is going to speak flawlessness flawlessness and um you know you're going to use the body wash to bathe morning and night this lotion use it on your skin morning and night as well and um on my next video i will be dropping the half cast facial cream also i got this comment like since i said the body wash can be used on the facial skin i should also drop a facial soap for you guys to use in order to to complement the body lotion and the facial cream so my next video now will be on the face cream and on the facial soap and then we'll move to the next 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 video i love you guys good see you on my next video ciao